Imagine waking up every morning with the certainty that you can address any challenge that deposes you. You can't imagine wake up every morning with certainty that you can address any challenge. Don't feel that he deposits truth in you, gripped by anxiety or doubt. You just feel strong, empowered to face the day with confidence. But how can you achieve this feeling of tranquility and, well, dear stoic warrior in the video of today? We will be reflecting about the ways to deal with them, challenges of life and in the way you, you see yourself according to the mirror, daily life according to stoicism. And first of all, clear your mind of negative thoughts and concerns is a clear call to action for those who sit overwhelmed by life to clear your mind of negative thoughts and concerns. You should focus on acceptance and personal growth. Focus on present consciousness and observe your thoughts without judging them, without identifying with them. Accept that negative thoughts are just that thoughts and that do not define you. Reality finds time to reflect and connect with yourself. Exercising, meditating or by practicing yoga. Learn to replace negative thoughts for positive ones, remembering moments of triumph and achievements. Create a positive environment around you, surrounding yourself with people who support you, and they make you feel good. Focus on him, present and don't worry about the past or the future. Learns to see yourself with compassion and empathy, as if you were a friend who needs support. Doesn't even judge you. Criticize yourself, and don't allow yourself to negative thoughts dominate you. Life is a path of growth and learning, and challenges are opportunities to grow and improve. So that instead of clearing your mind of negative thoughts and worries, learn to live with they already use them as impulses to grow and evolve. Live every moment with authenticity and joy. Face them life's challenges require reflection and determination in the mirror of life daily. You face an image that it reflects your ability to overcome obstacles and achieve goals away. Effective in addressing this challenge is set clear goals and work towards. They consistently imply this identify your objectives and analyze them necessary steps to achieve and create them, an action plan to overcome the obstacles that get in the way of you. I walk by looking at you in the mirror of the daily life. You must face your fears and doubts and recognize your strengths and weaknesses. You must be honest with yourself same and admit that you can't do everything alone, but you can't expect them either. Others solve your problems is important to set realistic goals and don't expect instant results. Once you have set your goals, you must work towards them in a way systematic and disciplined. This implies dedicate time and effort to your goal and don't let distractions and excuses distract you as you, you move towards your goals. You must adjust and adapt to the changes and obstacles that arise on the path. It is important to have faith in yourself and believe that you are capable of overcome any challenge. You must be patient and compassionate with yourself and not judge your actions or mistakes when looking at you in the mirror of daily life. Remember that you are a human being who can learn to constantly grow and improve with determination and perseverance. You can overcome any obstacle and reach your goals. As we face obstacles, we must make decisions informed and brave. You should not hesitate. Do what is best for us themselves and accept that life is a growth and learning process in the mirror of daily life. Not only we see our achievements reflected in mistakes, but also our ability to adapt, improve ourselves and grow, where we discover our resistance, our perseverance and our ability to learn from our mistakes, make decisions informed, and do not hesitate to do what is better for ourselves does not mean be reckless or impulsive, but be aware of our objectives and prioritize our values and needs. It means being honest with us, same about our limitations and skills and seek support when it. We also need to see reflected our fears and doubts, but we shouldn't let ourselves be paralyzed by them. We must face them with courage and conviction and trust our ability to overcome them. By doing so, we discover that the mirror of life is not just a reflection of our external appearance, but also a reflection of our strength inside a person who learns to say not effectively not just as one form of self-protection, but as one tool to set limits healthy and respectful with time, energy and emotion by saying, no, I am not giving up my objectives or my relationships, but I'm prioritizing what's important for me and what not to set limits. It's like drawing a perimeter inside your life, a framework that allows you to maintain integrity and mental health when saying no. 
and you will protect your identity and your values, avoiding over-exploitation and burnout in this mirror of learning to distinguish between what is possible and what you don't and what you don't get carried away by social pressure or the expectation of others must be aware of your limits and you can't feel guilty for establishing them by saying you won't be there also learning to say yes to me same to your needs and your desires you will learn to be more authentic and live in a more autonomous way learn to with yourself is a key step to face the challenges of life when looking at yourself in it mirror of daily life you must learn to accept your limitations and strengths. Acceptance is not surrender. It is an act of courage that allows you to recognize your weaknesses and work on them without fear of failing. Sometimes we, we feel trapped in a fight constant against our defects, but, but this fight consumes our energy and it prevents us from growing. Instead, learn to accept your limitations and strengths and focus on developing your skills and talents in doing it. T. You will realize that you are not perfect, but you are not insurmountable either. Imperfection is what makes you human, and it allows you to grow and learn by connect with your own self too. You learn to listen to yourself and understand your needs and feelings. This allows you to make more decisions informed and authentic and develop a confidence in yourself that allows you face life's challenges with greater security and tranquility. Remember that life is not perfect and what the challenges are inevitable, but when learning to connect with your own self and accept you will be able to overcome your limitations and strengths, face them more firmly and resilience. Don't worry about being perfect, but for being authentic and being you, even by doing so, you will be able to face the challenges of life with greater confidence and security, and you will find a sense of peace and satisfaction in the life process. It constantly tests us with challenges and obstacles that may seem unbeatable, but it is precisely in those moments when we must learn to manage stress and not control us to achieve this. It is essential. Develop skills and strategies that allow us to face challenges effectively and constructive. It is important to recognize that stress is inevitable, but it is also possible. Learn to manage stress and we must not let him control us. We must manage it. Effectively develop a positive mindset and focus on what we can control instead of worrying about what not. We can change. Second, is it is essential to practice techniques, relaxation and reduce stress. Such as yoga or breathing meditation deep is also important set priorities and learn to say no when necessary to no overload, our energies and health. Mental is also crucial to cultivate one social and emotional support network, whether with family, friends, or a therapist, so we can talk about our feelings and receive support in moments of need. Lastly, it is crucial to remember that we are not heroes and that it is normal to experience feelings of stress and anxiety. The important thing is learn to recognize them and face them effectively instead of letting that control us by doing so. We can transform our challenges in growth opportunities and personal development and living one more life balanced and satisfactory. The key to facing the challenges of life is cultivating one loving and respectful relationship with your emotions, not repressing your thoughts but accepting them. And I understood when we faced challenges, it is natural to feel afraid, anxiety or frustration. Though many of us are going to repress these emotions trying to ignore them or deleting them. This may seem like one temporary solution, but really only it can increase tension and stress already, that we are not facing the cause of challenge but trying to escape from it. In place to repress your emotions, consider cultivating a loving relationship and respectful of them. She accepts that the emotions are natural and have purpose. Take advantage of the present moment and dedicate time to understand your thoughts and feelings that are making you feel. What do you need to handle it when doing this? You will realize that your emotions are not your enemy, but one guide for your growth and learning. You will be able to recognize patterns and cycles that they help you learn from your mistakes and make smarter decisions when you see yourself in the mirror of daily life. No. You see yourself as someone who fights against your emotions, but as someone who accept and use them to grow and evolve by doing this, you will be able to face life's challenges with confidence and wisdom and you will find one greater peace and satisfaction along the way.
it is also necessary to accept reality and see it with clarity. Without fear of the true, as if it were a mirror, we must look honestly and without judging. In that reflection, we can see our strengths and weaknesses, our achievements and failures. And that's there where we can make the decision change to grow and improve. Take time for yourself is crucial for face life's challenges. When we take time for ourselves, we can reflect on our thoughts, feelings and actions. We can identify the patterns negatives and work on changing them. For we can also positive patterns remember our achievements and celebrate them, which gives us confidence and motivation to move forward in this regard. Enjoy the activities that we relax and make us happy. Fundamental. We must not forget that the life is short and we should enjoy every moment something as simple as reading a good book to exercise, meditate, or doing something we are passionate about can be a refuge in times of stress and anxiety. So when looking at ourselves in the mirror of life daily, we can see not only our defects but also our virtues and potentialities and there we can find the strength to face the challenges and move forward with confidence. And hope life is a mirror that it reflects our mentality and attitude towards the challenges. When looking at our reflection, we realize that we can choose how to react to them instead of focusing on what we can't control. We develop an attitude positive and focused on what we can controlling this way. We become owners of our own life. And we give ourselves realize that we are not victims of the circumstances, but we are the ones who we choose how to react to them. Focus on what we can control. Like our attitude and our decisions, we can transform our challenges in growth opportunities and learning. We don't focus on it fear or stress, but in resilience and the determination. When looking at my reflection in the mirror of life, I see someone who is able to overcome obstacles and achieve your goals. I see someone who is strong expert and willing to learn from the mistakes when developing this attitude, positive and focused. I can face the challenges with confidence and security, knowing that I can control my own destiny. I hope you adopt this one anyway. Mentality to feel more resilient. Remember that tranquility and him domain are not permanent states, but with practice and perseverance, you can skills and strategies to by achieving them. We can learn to recognize our limits and strengths, a manage our thoughts and emotions and making decisions informed when looking in the mirror of life. We can see that tranquility and him domain are not fixed objectives, but more well a constant growth process and evolution. We can learn to accept uncertainty and finding peace in the present knowing that life is a constantly changing journey. Life is a mirror that reflects our emotions and thoughts and often shows us challenges and challenges. However, instead we can fear or deny his presence, learn to recognize them as opportunities to grow and improve ourselves. We ourselves must do that. Discover that tranquility and him dominion are not permanent states, but more like fleeting moments that are, they alternate with uncertainty and tension, Therefore, we must be aware of our thoughts, emotions, and actions, and develop one attitude of flexibility and resilience to face the challenges that we face they present and make us teachers of our lives, and find peace and tranquility in the middle of the thank you for being part of this journey towards an understanding and resilience. Stay present, remain resilient, and adopt the stoic mentality. Thanks for watching the video until the end. I hope you have it liked and that it has been helpful to you if you want more content like this. No, feel free to ask for it in the comments, like subscribe and share this video with your friends. Until the good luck.